Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and this is to answer a few questions about product keys that help you upgrade your Windows 7 computer to Windows 10. Um, so of course uh, like I talked about the loophole still exists where you can use a product key and upgrade to Windows 10 for free and a lot of you have actually successfully done it and told me yeah it, it works but there's a subset a small number of people that actually tell me well I tried and it says it can be upgraded with that key and that problem comes from what we call OEM keys OEM are keys that are from the uh, manufacturer so there's of course two types of keys that you have available on Windows there's regular keys from uh, buying Windows. So if you purchase Windows 7, for example, you've got an official product key, which is from a purchased Windows product. But if you bought a computer from a company, HP, Dell, Acer, and so on, you have a key on that computer that is an OEM key. It's an original equipment manufacturer key. It doesn't have the same value to Microsoft's uh, eyes because that version of Windows was paid a lot less than the um, official version of Windows. So this one is a mixed bag. I see some people telling me that OEM key I have does work. I see some people tell me that some OEM keys don't work. So the best way to know about it is to simply go to the upgrade process. Go to Windows uh, page, click upgrade. You can upgrade via the um, media creation tool if you want. And when it asks you to enter the product key, enter your product key from Windows 7. If it works, it's going to tell you, yeah, it's fine. We continue on the install. That means you're clear. You're okay. You're getting a free upgrade. If it doesn't work, it's going to tell you this key cannot be used for that. And that means that OEM key you have cannot be used, unfortunately. What's at least nice about it is that you know before any changes. So that product key that you enter, no changes has been done to your computer. You just, you know, stop the install process and you'll be back to your Windows 7 computer as usual. So at least you can try it. But unfortunately, yes, there's a, a number of people on OEM keys that unfortunately it doesn't work. So that's something you need to know. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.